Hey friends, today I'm gonna take you to a new store that sells Disney World props and memorabilia from the resorts and inside the parks. This place is phenomenal. They actually have props that were in Pandora and actual like pieces of things that were used to decorate Galaxy's Edge and you can buy this stuff here and you can buy it online because they have a Facebook group that ships. So let's go do this. The name of the establishment is Forever Vintage and Surplus and they actually have a Facebook group like I said that ships smaller items and uh, you can already see just from the outside I'm excited. That right there is a headboard for the beds at Disney's Pop Century. I think that is so awesome. That's a headboard. You can actually screw in the lights. That is magnificent. If I can carry this out of here, I would definitely buy it right now, but I really can't fit that on top of my car. They also have a whole entire bin of the Animal Kingdom Resort light fixtures. I might want to get one of these. They're only 15 bucks. These are the ones that are actually in the Animal Kingdom rooms. Oh wow. Look at all these mirrors from the different resorts. Disney's Polynesian Resort mirror, Disney's Wilderness Lodge mirror. These are really awesome. And they're not that expensive, $45, $25 for the gigantic Wilderness Lodge one. I've never understood why anybody would buy actually one of the luggage carts from the resorts, but that's a contemporary one. I would purchase that. I don't know what I would do with it. I would probably use it as a clothes hanger in a closet. That would be pretty nifty. If you're fans of the Disney Cruise Line, we've got the Disney Cruise Line stateroom blankets and also the Disney Cruise Line lampshades. Those look really awesome. They have a whole bunch of them. $45, that's pretty, that's pretty amazing. Take a look at these nifty pictures. That was an actual temporary exit sign for the Haunted Mansion when it was going through refurbishment. And then you see the Liberty Tree Tavern right there. I don't know if I can show it to you. I think that's really awesome. I mean, I love the Liberty Tree Tavern. Look at this rug right here. That is from the world of Disney. I think that is amazing. I would put this in my living room. I would definitely put that in my living room. Some nifty resort items, including the Beach Club Resort flounder pillows. And then they have the shower curtains from the resorts. This is the Beach Club shower curtains, $50. This is really nifty because this is a shower curtain from the Animal Kingdom Lodge. That is so decorative. That one's $75, but that's pretty rare to come by. This is so awesome. This is a Pirates room divider from Caribbean Beach Rooms, and I love this thing. It's really awesome. Huge, absolutely huge. $200 for this, but that's like a one-of-a-kind piece. I keep on saying stuff like that because it legitimately is. If you don't know somebody, this is the only way you can get it. We got some nifty chairs from the Polynesian and probably the coolest thing I've seen so far right here. These are props from inside Disney's Galaxy's Edge. That is crazy, right? Like they'll actually show you where they came from. They'll give you a picture for authentication and I think that's amazing. $325 to own a piece of history like that. I know some people would be like, what would you do with this? I would tell all my friends. <laughs> These are also from Galaxy's Edge. These are the gun racks that they have in the queue line for Rise of the Resistance and I think some other places. I think that's interesting because they're actually bought from the US military. There's also so much kitchenware in here. I can't even believe it. These are silverware from Cinderella's royal table i've never seen anything like that they have literally plates and plates and plates full of all of this stuff that was in the disney parks and resorts also very interesting these are the disney cruise line oceaneer stools 
I like those. I've never been on a Disney Cruise Line before, so I thought that was kind of fascinating. But take a look at these. These are vein pods from the Valley of Mora in Pandora. What? That's crazy. They actually light up too. I've never seen anything like those before. Do they even sell these in the park? If you know, let me know. I want to know in the comments because I'm kind of interested in getting one. You can see here we have the Animal Kingdom Lodge chairs, but that is a table from the Pop Century. I like that a lot. Isn't that nifty? Oh no, not Pop Century, All-Star Music Resort. Wow, pretty fancy. $95 for that table. That's not a bad deal. Ooh, and those are the Animal Kingdom lights out front that they're selling for $15. Ooh, <laughs> I get so excited. This is from the Disney Yacht Club resort picture and it actually shows you where it was hanging above the sofa in the rooms another cool resort rug right here this is from all stars the value resorts i don't know which one though but i think that's an awesome little find another nifty thing is disney's magic kingdom speedway props these are from the speedway probably before it went down for refurbishment I just think that's awesome for $12 to own a little bit of a piece of a ride like that because that is history right there. This is actually really cool. These are actually the signage that they use to advertise the t-shirts in the Disney, you know, merchandise locations and like the Emporium and stuff like that. And they have some of your favorite Disney t-shirts and these are the ones that are hanging on the wall. I don't know. I just think that is really cool. I love how they have all of the merchandise racks here. These are all racks like with the Mickey on them that they actually used to have in all the different stores and merchandise locations. It's a little nifty thing. Some of the change from Star Wars Galaxy's Edge that they actually have that was located all along the walls. I think that's interesting, only $10. Oh, I don't know about these keys, but that's pretty impressive if they were Pirates of the Caribbean keys. There is just so many nifty things here. Ooh, look at this aerial shot of the contemporary picture. That is cool, and that looks old. These are really nifty. If you like the Hollywood Brown Derby Lounge, they have the little hats that you can buy that they used to put in the cocktails. Only 50 cents, you can get a whole bunch of them. Or if you're like me and you buy a lot of mixed drinks, you just collect a lot of them. That is a really nifty find. <laughs> The Starbucks menu from inside the parks. Wow, they're the fall ones. I like that, that's awesome. I'm actually kind of interested in getting the pumpkin spice one. <laughs> I know that sounds funny, but I don't even know what I would do with it. It's still just kind of cool. I can literally just keep on pointing out stuff, guys, but there are so many different things in here. It actually blows my mind. They have literally a plethora of Disney Cruise Line chairs. I can't even believe, like, they must have bought tons of them. Look at how many Cruise Line chairs they are. They have almost every single bed skirt for the resorts. And they've got Animal Kingdom, Beach Club, They've got special event Mickey pillowcases. Look at that. Oh, this is from the Disney Cruise Line. Oh, Disney's old Key West ones. Everything. And all of them have little hidden Mickeys on them, which I think is a cool little tad to the mouse himself. These are also really awesome because these are all light fixtures from Disney. These are Coronado Spring Light fixtures. That's from the rooms at the Port Orleans. And then... All of these ones in the back, some of them we don't know where they're from, but I like this. I especially like the Port Orleans one. That's really cool. Here's the business card for Forever Vintage and Surplus. And look them up on Facebook because, like I said, they do ship and they will take offers on certain big items that you don't see here that they have posted on their Facebook page. And now I am back 
home. I want to show you what I actually picked up while I was at Forever Vintage. Make sure you guys check them out. They're only open on Saturdays, so you should check out their Facebook. They do sell stuff through there and ship, but you want to see if it's worth it to make the Saturday trip or not by looking at the stuff that they have on their Facebook page, which actually makes things easier. But this is what I picked up while I was there. I left with one of the cool vein pods from Pandora. Look at it. I got it plugged in. It's all lit up. I'm going to shut the lights off. That is so cool. I really like this. It's perfect for my little coffee area. <laughs> and that's going to do it for me. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I really think it's such a cool place. Let me know what your favorite thing is and if you've ever bought anything from there or what would you buy? That's the cool question actually because they always have new stuff. The uh, Galaxy's Edge props were pretty amazing. It's just I don't know what you would do with them except for like if you were a big collector. But I don't know about that big gigantic bulky thing just sitting in my kitchen. I don't think it'll look that good, but it'd be awesome to have and to tell your friends. So, uh, until next time, bye.